Everybody knows that Jersey has some of the hottest hangouts in Mzansi. But where exactly are you meant to go? Especially if you want to be seen. Well, who better to tell us than socialite and celeb Nontle Tema. Bridget took her out on the town and got all the inside info. The city of Josie is filled with electric energy, reflective of its summer thunderstorms. It's a gritty, exciting city that is intoxicating and addictive. Melrose Arch is one of those trendy hotspots that's buzzing with that energy at the moment. Today, I'm at the Fire and Ice Hotel to meet up with the vivacious Nodette Hammer and hang out at her favorite hotspot. It is so good to see you looking lovely as always. Thank you. So why did we choose Fire and Ice? It's so beautiful. Oh, well, uh, this is actually one of my favorite places. I love Melrose Arch. And this particular hotel is not only exclusive, but it's just kind of intimate. And they've got the best cocktails. And I've already ordered some for us. So hopefully you're ready to get this party started. Well, let's have a taste of these beauties. Looking yes. lovely. Do you want a toast? Yes, to... Um, life and just beautiful things around us. Oh, this is nice. Very, very nice. Oh, for a virgin cocktail, very nice. So an ex-boyfriend of mine actually introduced me to a mojito. Oh, really? So yeah, it's sentimental? Golden. Yeah, so uh, every time I drink one, you know, there's a moment of attachment. <laughs> <laughs> is this the kind of place where normally you would hang out? Definitely. Um, I like exclusive places, uh, places that are a bit private. Uh, where you can just bring a couple of friends and hang out and catch up uh, without really having to be around a lot of people and like too much noise. So, and I, I also like the deco. It's very nice and modern and sophisticated. It's very me. Old Hollywood glamour flows through to your dining experience at the trendy in-house restaurant, which serves lavish cuisine in an intimate and relaxed dining environment. Now you said that you are a I don't want to say homebody. Yes. Because you do go out, you just yes, don't go out a lot. I've enjoyed my time going out and partying and the nightlife. And uh, now and again, when I have a moment to breathe, I, I chill at home. Do you go to spots where a lot of celebrities frequent? Not really. Uh, if I'm invited to an event, it's someone's launch or I'm supporting a friend, then I'll go and obviously the celebrities are there and the nightlife will be around that event. So today you're looking very fabulous. I love the blue sequins. Thank you. Is this the dress code normally when we go out? This is the vibe right now. You know, dress to impress. You never know who you're going to meet out there. Potential husband, <laughs> potential business partner. You never know. Are we looking for a potential <laughs> husband? That's a conversation for another day, but I'm not married yet. <laughs> now, I know this is not the only place that you have planned for us today. Mm. What yes. else are we doing? We're about to go through to my favorite restaurant, Pigal, which is just around the corner right here in Melrose Arch. Pigal Melrose Arch offers a warm and contemporary feel that stays true to the Arch's metropolitan lifestyle. The restaurant juxtaposes the trendy with the elegant, the lavish gold with the rich chocolate browns and butter soft suede chairs, the sparkling crystal with the soft lighting to create a perfectly balanced, eclectic and comfortable space. I love Pigal. Not only does it have my favorite food, which is seafood, it also has some steak, uh, some Portuguese food, so it's a nice variety. And the one in Cape Town has a live band. Oh, so when you want to get the party started, that's the best place to be in Cape Town, Greenpoint. And you are getting the party started right yet. Thank I you. know. Can you imagine? So it is a ladies' night out. It is indeed. <laughs> so what are we drinking tonight? What's on the menu? Ooh, we're having yeah. um, watermelon martini. No, alcohol inside. Oh, wow. And she's having uh, apple martini. Well, I can't wait to taste. It looks beautiful. Watermelon. I forgot the name. It's a watermelon martini. Oh, fabulous. <laughs> so recently, we saw you going to Hollywood. Mm. Nantley goes to Hollywood to uh, try your luck in the big pot. How was that experience? Wow. Firstly, just getting a show. My own show was just a dream come true. Who, I mean, that's like a dream for anybody that's in the industry. So it was just time that we, we felt, um, why not do something groundbreaking on South African TV? Have a reality show uh, about a South African trying to crack it into the cutthroat business in Hollywood. And why not somebody like me who's actually been there, so who understands the game and who can also kind of, who is trying to make a career in Hollywood. So I'm kind of like just bringing the cameras in my, my personal life. What is the lifestyle like in LA in comparison to Johannesburg? In, in America, though, the 
girls don't pay at the clubs. The finer you look, <laughs> the faster you get inside. But here at home, people make you pay to get into the clubs and what you look like, I don't think really matters that much. Doesn't really, Bridget? <laughs> I think it does. Maybe South Africans don't take it to that level. Yes. But, yes. It, you know, if you're a girl and you're fine, and by the way, <laughs> you don't pay at the club before 10. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Right, so it kind of works the same way, right? Where are you going to be in the next five years, ten years? What are we seeing from Nantle? I'm coming up with a Nantle Tema fragrance, which will also be something aimed for young girls to, once they use it, they kind of feel empowered, they feel strong, they feel that they're stars themselves, um, and they feel that they can also go out there, achieve their dreams, and conquer the world. <laughs> good note for us to have a drink on. Yay! You like you know, my plan? I'm, I'm loving this plan. That? I'm loving the plan. Thank you. Mm -hmm. It's been a great night out with Nontle and it goes to show that it doesn't matter where you prefer to hang out and have fun, just as long as you're doing it in good company.